Good afternoon. It's 50, and the promise of another 50 basis points in cuts by the end of the year. On September 18th, the Federal Reserve began its highly anticipated easing cycle in their professed attempt to bring interest rates closer to the neutral rate. Since that moment, something very odd has happened, though. Interest rates with durations beyond the Fed funds rate have been in a straight path higher, not lower, with 10-year yields, which were at 3.6% at the time of the ease, having now shot up to an eight-month high near 4.8%. The most common theory as to why rates are rising seems to be centered around a couple points. One, perhaps the Fed is premature in its cuts, and that could reignite inflation. Two, the policies of the incoming administration could be inflationary also, either through tariffs or through aggregate demand spurred by tax and regulatory cuts. Of course, persistent inflation makes holding longer duration bonds much less attractive as it eats into returns. Now, 10-year break-evens seem to support the inflation worries as that index has jumped from near 2% in September to 2.46% currently. A third possibility is that perhaps there is a belief that if policies of the new administration are more friendly toward businesses, that could redirect money from the safety of bonds into riskier assets like equities. Traders now will be hyper-focused on any inflation indicator and the U.S. labor market for any significant changes.